piece of work uh, uh, is just like you. We specialize in custom headwear. Okay, we're switching again. This is just, we're all over the map today, baby. This, it, it may be unboxing 13, Ass Clown Brewing Company. Ooh, this is like a big view of me now on YouTube. Vibin, Axe Club, Sugar Creek, some interesting stuff. Hey, Joe Cocker. Feel like are we frozen on the other? Are we frozen on Instagram? Let's push this over here. Closer. All right. Much better now. They're saying much better. I don't know. All I see is much better, much better. I don't know what the fuck any of it means. Whiskey Dick, the X-rated drinking game. The adult drinking game where you find out just how fucked up your friends really are. Drink up if you've ever been loaded at a child's birthday party. Come on, that's fucking... If you're not loaded at a kid's fucking birthday party, you're fucked up. Drink up if you ever watched porn at work. Pirate Simon, shout out. Call your mom and tell her she has a nice ass. Well, that's, that's, I mean, that's just, that's fucked. That's not even fuck, fuck. That's, like, we went through three extremes. One, like, oh, to get drunk. Yeah, you don't call your mom and tell her she has a nice ass. That's fucking, you know what they call that? Fucking incest. And if you watch incest porn, even though, listen, incest porn, even if I know it's like actors, still, like, you're fucking nuts. And I like some weird shit, but that's a little bit much. Him. YouTube's getting a beautiful view of my fucking... Yeah, where... The, it's gotta be the fucking Wi-Fi. Because now this is, like, fucked. It's gotta be the Wi-Fi. My guy Pete. My guy Pete's the worst to ever do it. Because we're going up on this and on the other, but it's, like, frozen. Hence. Hence. Cherry Wing flavored gummies. I like the real deal. I don't know who sent me the Laffy Taffy, but I wouldn't hate more of it. Is he on here? I can't even look anymore. It's just fucking busted. How is the Instagram? Does Instagram work? Well, there's nothing I can fucking do. I can just sit here and yell at the moon. I can just yell at the moon. I'll just fucking yell at the moon. What is this? Goldfish. Goldfish. Where are you from? Tara. I trust girls. For some reason, I feel like even though maybe it was a girl who sent me the fake fucking... What is this? Ooh. A, a bedtime story for Randolph. Dear Randolph, to help you fall asleep fast in your new home, sound and sweet, we've sent this book to your fish daddy to read you as a bedtime treat. Instead of nightmares of scary dragon heads or getting eaten by Mortimer, you can now dream of Hawaiian islands and feeling much sunnier. So sleep tight, dear little Randolph. Dream of catching that wave with this tale from Hawaiian Children Book, narrated by Daddy Dave, from Tara, daughter of the author and illustrator of Goodnight Gecko. Okay, I don't really know what that means. Goodnight Gecko. I'll read that fucking shit for Randolph. Randolph, by the way, since we cleaned his water, has been like... Really good. I think now my head's cut off on YouTube. We gotta move that shit back. Let's see what we got over here. Now we lost the fucking. Did this thing like that for It is gone up, down, frozen. I don't know. It's a fucking. We're good. Yeah. I'm cut off though on YouTube. My head's in the clouds. Pick the where you want it. Okay. There we go. Now you can see my pretty fucking face. All right. Dude, David. Michelle. By the way, for the internet people who don't know what Barstool deals with, our guy, All Business Peak, tech guy, like this, we're an internet company, he just doesn't give us internet. We were in this office, this is how it was. It's a miracle we got it. He just doesn't give a fuck. He'll just... What's in here? Okay, are you gonna ice me? What is this, is this icing? And then you yeah, just smear off ice. Listen, I've gotten a hundred. Bell Fred. Purple. 
bring back mixed tapes. Go build. You'll like this shirt. I like the shirt. Bring back mixtape. I do like mixtape. What's going on over there? Oh, yeah. Okay. This has been a... I do want to bring back mixtapes. What am I wearing right now? Yeah, I'll fucking go with it. I do want to bring back mixtapes. What a fucking shit show this sound has been. The internet has been. Marshmallow has been. The whole fucking works. Look at this hair. I haven't had a haircut in fucking since quarantine started. Just things on. Unreal. All right. Bradley Loyette. Fuck Jax, fuck Carol Baskin, fuck that bitch, Roger Goodell, the boys at BP. Custom fabric. There we go. Let's see if this thing works yet. We're going back and... I don't understand. I don't understand. I'm pressing you. I'm pressing a button over here. It's supposed... To... No, not you. Not fucking you. This fucking... Technology is not my thing. Is he in there? I have no idea if he's in there. It, it won't open. I keep doing it to you. Oh, it's your... Wait, where's my fucking phone? That's why I don't know what I'm doing. It's a fucking... Whatever, I give up. Give up. We're on the wrong fucking thing. How do we... There we go. Just fucking... We'll just leave it. We'll just go. I have no idea. Uh, Sharp Trophies by Mac. Now, this is fucking... My head's cut off. This is it. This, this has been like fucking, we're doing the unboxing one fucking here. We can't get nothing to work. We're better off in my fucking apartment just sitting there by myself with one phone. At least it fucking worked. One bite. Everyone knows the rules. I think I already got one of the fucking these. Right, let's go here, up, and we'll just go. Fuck it. I'll talk to them after. We'll figure it out. There's going to be more unboxings. We'll figure it the fuck out. Jamie's Spanish Village. Heavy uh, chili con queso. Hey, they gave a card. I'll read the fucking card. Muchos gracias. Find us on Amazon, Texas Whole Foods. A lot of boxes, little time. All right, there you go. Amazon, it's all about Amazon. Hey, what do you got? Oh, my shoulder. What do you guys think this is? What do you guys, what do you guys think this is, brah? If you want the ultimate, you're going to be willing to pay the ultimate price. It'll change your life. Surfing's the source. Point Break, one of my all-time favorite movies. I tried to bid. Little known fact. Tried to bid. Your hands in the fucking way. I tried to bid on the surfboard from Point Break. They, it was on uh, one of those big auction houses. I bid 20 grand on Bodie's surfboard. It went for like 100 grand. In hindsight, I should have just bought that and had something to show for it rather than just fucking all losing stocks. I don't, I don't read with this. I'll fucking shred with this. Maybe. It's like a duster board though, probably. I'm very curious to see what it, what does it say? At surf underscore signs. Oh, so it's a sign, not a surfboard. You can't actually fucking catch a ride with those. Shout out Anastasia Ashley. Great ass. Put my face in it when she gave me a lesson. She's now engaged, so no big deal. Hank also sent her nudes. <laughs> what a world. We're going. What does this say? Oh, you can smell the paint. What the fuck? Oh, it's in half. Hi, my name is Justin. I'm a healthcare professional on the front lines in COVID. I'm from Jersey Shore, LBI. My girlfriend got laid off, so we started a business. She's an artist. I love surfing, so we put our love together and made BJ Surf Signs. Hope you enjoy it, Beck and Justin. What a cool fucking story. It's actually fucking awesome for like, I don't know, oh, my fucking hand. For an like a surf community. This fucking thing's not easy to get off, I'll tell you that. All right. Our 
to the sports one by. That's pretty fucking cool. That's really cool. Hang that in the Nantucket house. That's if you have a Nantucket house. I, I do have a Nantucket house. Right? We are struggling holding this thing up on the YouTube side. And I think we have bad internet on the Instagram side. Hey, Dave, my wife, I'm big fans. Really enjoy the unboxing. Saw you like pistachios. Yeah, no, I love pistachios. Enjoy some pistachio butter. I didn't even know there's such a thing. Pistachio look, cookies. What? Dashing through the dough. Gourmet chocolate chip cookie butter. Must be pistachios. Must be the other one. Oh, that guy slipped up on me. All right. One at a time. One at a time. I forgot you were up here. Hair Roth and Harry Roth and Sons. Harry Roth and Sons. Harry Roth and Sons. Dave. What do we got? 2018 Haskell horse race. Ooh, that's some fancy fucking embroidery. Love Monmouth Park. Join us at Box 46 anytime. Watch out, dude. I'll fucking take you up on that. I'll fucking take you right the fuck up on that. All right. What is this guy? Mark Russell. This thing's complicated. A little bit of a puzzle. Make your brain work. A little late night fucking quarantine. By the way, I've totally fucking lost track of quarantine. I mean, I think I told you. I thought it was 2021 for real. I have no idea what day of the week it is. I have no idea what's going on. I just sit and fucking get fat watching my stocks go down. Are we getting a suit? Looks like we're getting a fucking suit. All right. How do you get this thing off the pole? That's what she said. Get it? Like stripper pole? Dude, this box is putting a whooping on me. This box is fucking putting a whooping on me. That's what she said. Again, you can play there. Come on, you motherfucker. I don't want to ruin whatever the fuck. I mean, obviously, it's a jacket. Mark Russell. Dave. You're the best dressed man on the internet. Enjoy this jacket and... Pizza cufflinks? Mark Russell? Alright, let's see what we fucking got. Mark Russell? I'm going, I'm going. Everyone chill the fuck out. I'm trying to do it as fast as I can. This hand, Hall of Fame stuff. It is in shambles. Bloody. You go, look at my sheets. If you go look at the sheets in my house, they're just, they were white. I washed them. Blood everywhere. Just blood everywhere. That's just the, that's the life of an unboxing man. You just have blood everywhere. This thing's going to be way too hot. It's like wool. I'm actually, sleeve's a little short. I'm generally like a 42 regular, like perfect. Not bad. Pizza cufflinks. I kind of want to see the pizza cufflinks. Oh, yeah, pizza cufflinks. The YouTube people. All right, take this off so I don't sweat to death. Is that a package or an open? That's an open. Can't believe I got allergies with grapes. Barman, bar, barman arts. Barman arts. I don't know what that means. Barman arts. Well wrapped. Well wrapped. Can I be considered a professional like evaluator of wrapping when this thing's all done? I think I probably can. Open here, dude, but I already opened it. You're a package within a package. You're a package within a fucking package. Is this me and Michael Scott? I think it's fucking me and Michael Scott. Dave, I'm a stencil artist from Canastota, New York. I figured that a piece consisting of the world's two best bosses would be perfect unboxing. Hand cut by me took eight and a half hours. The further back you are, the clearer the picture gets. Okay. Let's see if that holds true. Is this like fucking super clear now? It's actually pretty clear all the way around. That's very cool. Listen. I don't even care if that took you 10 minutes. If you say it took eight and a half hours, I'm going to give you like the time of day on the unboxing. Quavos. 
Isn't that a band? Don't they fucking Quavos? Are they a band or am I making that shit up? Quavos. Little bread shit with like sour cream and onion. Quavos. Is Quavos a thing? Is Quavos a band? Quavos. Quavos. It's like a shout out in, um, is it a Bieber song or, or DJ Khaled? Quavos. Am I making that up? I don't know, fucking know. It, I was supposed to have Marshmallow fucking spinning tunes. We couldn't get him on. And he's like, I don't have my equipment. And I was told he didn't, he didn't fucking talk, but I guess he does. I'm going to have to figure this shit out with Marshmallow out there. I thought that was like a big get. I'm like, oh shit, I'm gonna have marshmallow on fucking the unboxing. People, the guys get 30 fucking million followers. Or girl, who knows? Didn't happen. What is this wrapped up like this for? Okay, Pat, tell me. Sign these. I uh, listen, I would sign these. This is like what. Do you see what I do? Like when I, all right, I'll sign it. And if you can get it to somebody, another question. And I've always wondered this. When people ask me to sign, I don't want to like be sucking my own dick here, but I do get occasionally asked for autographs. Do you, would you sign it, El Prez or Dave Portland? It's a tough one. I go with El Prez. I don't think they give a fuck who Dave Portland is. So, and I go El Presidente, full. And if I really like you, oh. I got all of myself. And if I really like you and think you're like fucking really want the autograph, I'll do the pirate dog. But now that's it. <laughs> that's what I mean. I thought that guy's going to get that. What is this? William Turner. I don't like little ones. Little ones make me nervous. Think I'm getting fart spray. Yeah, that's why. Uh, Just chains. Good flip, Dave. Professional flip right there. Professional fucking flip. Sorry, kid show. I don't mean to use the language. But I say the F word a lot. It's just my nature. I always wonder that. Like, kids who are watching pizza reviews, they get a lot of, like, kids watching pizza reviews. And I'm just slinging it. I'm like, fuck this, fuck that. It's a kid show. What is this? Northwest Art. The Dementors. Wor the worst thing about... Oh! 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 This is fucking cool. I was reading it. Michael Scott. I'm reading the head. The worst thing about prison. The worst thing about prison was the Dementors. Uh, what, that is worthy of being hung. Auction. By the way, we. Can I tell you people that I fucking hate? Like truly hate. Like wish I could take this box cutter and cut their vocal cords out. The people who tweet me and email me be like, people should be sending presents to the fucking nurses dude we're, gu we're giving back first of all we raised money we've done a ton of charity already we're gonna do more charity and we're giving this shit all away to first responders so shut up this is called entertainment what do you why don't you do it why don't you fuck we're like we're just trying to entertain i didn't ask for this shit so yeah yeah i want to cut out their vocal cords sorry if it's extreme i'm sorry this has to be a weapon we have so many weapons so many ways. Honestly, like, I don't want to say we could get into the black market with, like, a Middle Eastern company, that uh, country that would later turn on everybody. We could do a whole militia. Box in a box. Greenworks. Cordless. What? A cordless chainsaw? That's fucking, you just chainsaw somebody face off. Horror movie city. Oh yeah. Matches my shirt too. Woo. I thought that I almost just hurt myself. Is, is that Jason? I thought they gave me a Jason mask. I thought I had a Jason mask with it. Just, just a fucking chainsaw. Pull that thing up and just walk down the street and the, but, Another thing, I walk home after this from the unboxing and the city's dead. I see you. Um, the city's dead. There's no one out there. It's the only time in New York City I've been like a little bit nervous to walk. Just tiny bit. It's like, oh, well, someone could murder me. Not if I'm holding a chainsaw or my 30 samurai swords. All right. So gold belly getting double here. 
I don't know if this is from Gold Belly or someone else. They sponsored the pizza review. Shout out Gold Belly. Uh, Goldbelly.com slash Dave. And they had some code for 15% off. Expensive from I've gathered, but they deliver everywhere. You name it, any pizza you want, they deliver it the next day. It can be expensive, like a rich person thing maybe. I don't know, it could be anybody's thing. But any pizza you want, any food you want, Gold Belly gets to you the next day. And there is 15% off. It's like Belly Dave or something. I don't remember what the Dave Belly for 15% off. So they sent a ton of t-shirts and they get the shine. Listen, if you're gonna fucking advertise in this climate with us, so we can keep all those no good slime balls who work for me fucking employed, you get the shout out. Somebody's gotta pay their bills. Gold Belly did. Ash Ali, British Columbia, Canada. Shout out Canada. Oh. What? Is there a note to come off? Yeah, there is. Hey, Prez, we know how much you like eating pizza, but we thought you might also like to eat ass. Yeah, why not? It's fucking anything goes in fucking Corona times. How is this an eat ass shirt, though? Am I missing something? Do I miss how this signifies eating ass? I like this shirt. I'll support the eating ass, but I don't get at all how this is like an eating ass shirt. Just looks like a fucking shirt that you should do mushrooms on. Also, smells like absolute smoke. To the point I would have done a lot not to have put it on because even though I kind of look fucking good in it, this does a lot. It's not like clean to me, um, but it smells like a million cigarettes. Just a million, that's all. Not, not like 100,000, not 999,000. This smells like a million cigarettes. Oh, Jesus Christ. Somebody was rolling around and fucking busting this thing, and now I'm wearing it like a fucking dickhead. I will not shower when I go to bed. Oh, I'm disgusting myself even as I fucking talk about it right now. I need a shirt. I like the shirt. I like the way it fucking looks. Don't like the way it smells. Not even a little bit. I think I got another paper cut. All right. How about... Sometimes I go so aggressively at opening these things, like right there, I went brain over brawn. Lesson for the kids. Sometimes brain beats brawn. It just did. It just fucking did. Just pretty. Just fucking pretty. My off time from work, I enjoy doing uh, custom woodworking. Specifically, I create signs and decor. Um, let me know what you think. And if you ever want a special order, feel free to reach out. Cost on me Instagram. Uh, this is going to be a long Instagram. At Philip Serik 9 z So if you want to check out his other work, there it is. There it is. I think I told most people probably on this thing. I, I don't know. I don't know if it's hardcore stoolies or not. Our logo. So when Barcel started, it was a newspaper. I had one of my buddies, the guy who actually had sent a couple packages, Trey Petro. He drew me an elaborate design. I took the design to the newspaper guy. We were ready to print our first issue. He's like, this is way too detailed. It won't come out. Paper was due in like two minutes. I'm like, all right, well, we got to do something. Went into clip art, picked out the Barstool. That's where we got our fucking logo from. This shirt stinks. Wow. I almost just went skins. I almost just went fucking skins wholesale. I'm still scared of animals. What? What are you? From your Monster Hits Only Club. A little weed action? Dwarf? All right, I'll take it. What's in here? More weed? A weed carrier. I wonder if there's weed in here. What is this? Lucid Customs? I don't, what is that? A pen? I don't know. I'm not, like, I'm not great at weed. I smoke it, I get fucked up, I'll do a little tanga tonga, but that's about fucking it. Like, I, I'm not, I can't roll a joint. It's embarrassing, but I can't. Right. Bourbon? There is a big note in here. Brett, uh, Bradley's dessert. Let's see what the note says. 
Hey, if you write, read a note, I'll try to give you the time. My name is Tom Garnier. I'm a restaurant manager and longtime stool. We got a quick story for you. All right, everyone, buckle up. It's fucking Kelly Kapoor story hour. In the summer of 2016, my wife and I received some bad news. Okay, well, this is going to get fucking a little bit intense. You can tell right off the bat for uh, just casual quarantine boxing. Okay, in the summer of 2016, my wife and I received some bad news. Doctors told us that we would not be able to conceive a child without medical help and that uh, the odds are stacked against us. Fast forward to February 5th, 2017, Super Bowl uh, LI. I'm not good at Roman numerals. While watching the game, my wife and I decided that our beloved Patriots could find a way to win down 28-3. We're going to start trying for a baby. Like, that just means fucking? Is that what that means? Uh, the Pats weren't the only ones with a come-from-behind victory that night. Nine months later, our son Brady was born. It was a miracle. All right. All right. This story's fucking kind of cool. Encloses a bottle of bourbon that I personally handmade. It was barreled in the begin. It was barreled and has been aging since November 18th, 2017, my son's birthday. I have the bottles left. I have two bottles left after this one. One is for my son's 21st birthday. The other is for Tom Brady. Is there any way you could help me get a bottle in Tom's hands? I would be in forever your debt. Much love, stay safe, and thanks for all the laughs. Tom and Brady. What a story, fucking. So this is, oh, it's literally called Brady's Reserve. I think we probably can get it in his hands. With the note, that's a fucking ridiculous story. So, little known fact here, which I I haven't said in the unboxing. The guy who is so... And whenever, I don't know if this guy knew that or this just guy got lucky. Let me back up. Let me back up here. Probably like three, four, six months ago, I'm like, I need a new right-hand guy. Like, I'm like, I, I need somebody. Because Frankie, who is my guy, pizza guy, doing foreplay, doing a bunch of shit, too busy, can't just concentrate on me. So he put out a, a hire. It's like, who wants to be my guy? I've been interviewing recently, just started in the quarantine. It was turned around. Guy Kevin, who's now my right-hand guy, just started quarantine he was Tom Brady's right-hand man before mine. So, weirdly, he will be able to get that to him. Full fucking circle. What a fucking world. I almost don't know if that guy knew that, and that's why he fucking did it. Unreal. And no, I'm not allowed to get any Tom. I don't even want to know his Brady stories, because I know me. I'll just fucking say it. I did ask him why he was in Tampa Bay throwing in a park as opposed to his backyard. He's like, he's very particular about the size of the yard. Disposable breast milk bags. All right, I'm down with that. Except, ah, oh, that's, well, this is not my fault. This is just sent totally the wrong. The breast milk, somebody's missing their breast milk. Somebody's missing their fucking breast milk. Not our fault. It's not even it's not even close to the right address they sent this to. It's not even close. But somebody in quarantine right now, a baby somewhere is like, yo, I need my fucking breast milk. Where is it? And it's just got unboxed live. That's too bad. What are we at? We're uh, uh we're about twenty thousand, twenty-three thousand people total. You know what? I think I don't know how the service is. But if I'm judging myself as an actor and like a comedian and like an unboxer, I think this has been as on point as I've been. Outside the shirt that smells. I felt good. The Adderall is. You give me Adderall and I swear to God I can cure cancer. I should be doing Adderall on my trade. I have it because I've been, I do this for you. I do this for you guys. I'm saving my Adderall for night when I should be taking it in the morning. Then I won't be asleep at the switch. Wikis. What are these just fucking... Jalapenos or something? Uh, well, I don't care anymore. I don't care about fucking these things anymore. It's not my fucking apartment. That was a fucking insane story. Wikis, kind of a cool hat. Just two, <laughs> I like that hat. Just two fucking jalapenos dancing with each other. And it kind of matches. It almost looks like I'm wearing a jalapeno fucking uh, shirt. Yeah, it does. Again, TikTok. This is a vibe. Do I have to actually see what it is? It's just going to be jalapenos, right? Yeah. Spread. Spicy spreads and whatnot. 
but you got the hat with This looks like it was planned. I mean, that's serendipitous, right? It looks like I'm wearing a shirt that is meant to go with this hat. And by the way, I would wear out. What if I just start never wearing anything? Quarantine's over. We're going out, I'm going to club, fancy, whatever, and I'm just wearing purple sweatpants. Can I do that? I feel like athletes do that. Like, hey, we're too cool, so we're just gonna wear sweats everywhere. Fragile, do not puncture. Contents are not alive. You know, you know what somebody would say contents are? That contents are not alive is exactly what somebody would say who sent contents that are alive. Just saying. Just saying. Contents are not alive. Well then, like, are they though? They don't look it, but I'm not convinced because it's, I can't see what it is. Thought you might like more than Old Forge pizza. Okay, if you're sending, what? I don't, I don't understand these pillows. I haven't been able to fucking figure them out yet. All right, here we go. What is this? How do you fucking see what this is? Oh, black dick. Black dick, black huge fucking dong. We got a black, a huge fucking black dong. You knew it wasn't gonna be like a run of the mill. You knew when they're like, it's not alive. Yeah, but it kind of was. In a different way, it very much was. Nature gift store. Nature. Nature. What does that fucking mean? Nature. I have such the yips. And you would too if you had cockroaches and dead fish shit sent to you. I think this is something. What is this? Yeah, it's a frog. Yeah, this is frogs. I, tadpoles, frogs. Yeah, why, why send shit, people? Like, I'm not opening it, I'm being clear. Like, how do you like, what is this in here? What did they send? Tadpole to frog kit. Number of tadpoles kit with one live tadpole. One, why would you send fucking tadpole? Like, how would you like to be, whoever that was, whoever sent that, I'd like to send them in the mail. See how they fucking like it. Stupid car trick, a tadpole. I used to go try to catch tadpoles in the kid, but I'd catch and release because I'm a fucking humanitarian. Hi, Dave, we're stupid car tray. Okay, it's just a car tray that like, looks like you can eat off of in the car and whatnot. Not a bad invention, put that next to you. You gotta be real fatso though if you need that. Like, you can't wait two minutes, but guess what? A lot of fatso's, I'm not gonna criticize that. Perishables. Kim Haynes, perishables. It's tough now to send perishables because we're not at the place. So if you send perishables, they're probably gonna die. Including like animals. What? No, cream, okay. Cool card. It's gotta be some sort of cake. Ooh, this girl's a pretty girl. Look at this, pretty girl. Dave, thank you for showing support, being the voice behind small business. Please enjoy the vanilla flavored pizza macarons. And remember, one bite everyone knows rules. You're the shit. Kind, re kind regards. Kim Haynes? Is it Haynes? Oh, phone number digits. Fuck. I just got asked out. Judge it on the, on the macaroon, I guess. It's turned into a dating show. What a sly way to do it. I don't know how she ever thought I'd see that number though. Like I saw it at the very end. This, remember when I was like brains versus brawn on how to open shit? I went brawn because it was, I had testosterone flowing out to get numbers. This thing's packaged like a motherfucker. How is this perishable though? Okay, we're like right back at ground zero here. Okay. 
Would I be putting this much effort in if it was just a fat guy who sent it? Probably not, but that's how life works. Crane pizza macarons. These are pretty fucking fire looking. Ooh. Let's give these a shot. Uh, I don't know that I actually can because I don't want to touch them. All right, we'll do it later. I can't, I can't, it, oh, well, whatever, I'll do it later. Phone number, I mean, you gotta take it, right? It's such fucking pretty handwriting, it'd be rude not to do that. Uh, let's go next. All the tape was just to cover the box. What? It says all the tape was just to cover the box. What the fuck does that mean? No shit. Like, what do you think I don't know what the tape is for? I mean, I know what the tape is for. It's to package the fucking thing. All right. Megan Campbell. I nailed it decor. I like that name. I didn't need a history lesson. I want to put tape on the box. Ooh. I kind of saw it. Looks like a dartboard almost. But it's not a dartboard. Oh, maybe it is. I nailed it. Yeah, it is. Wait, world's greatest boss. It's like half knit if you look in there. It's pretty fucking cool. I'm going to have so many of these. When people want like barstool shit for their house, college dorm, because I have a lot of it. Like I can only put up. So I have a whole gallery. What does this say here? Hey, Dave, I'm a small town girl from Wisconsin. Just want to say thank you for your ways of sharing the world. That's okay to embrace the crazy and be different. She called me crazy. Here is my knack of a creation for you. I nailed it to core Megan Campbell. I think there's something else in here. Okay, I nailed it to core. If you want to look up sales at I nailed it to core, there you go. There's the shout out for small business, which I know I've said it a bunch, but as much as we're doing this, like, and I, the charity thing for real, I just haven't figured out exactly the way that I've done charity throughout barstool is i try to find places where we can make like a real difference like whether it be a restaurant bartenders something that's like we can give the money direct which we are going to do like we're thinking about doing the all-in challenge we made but the reason i well it started organically i didn't expect people to do packages but the reason we keep doing it is to give a little shout out so if you're watching this and you see something you like check out the store because that's the best way to help during quarantine that was fucking right here I just bled. I just bled it out. Let it all out. That's why I get mad when people don't fucking send notes. When people don't fucking send notes and just send shit and they don't know what they're doing as opposed to like they're watching and they need help and all that. Liku USA. Like the marketing people just send fucking whatever. But today's been pretty good packages, I feel like. Also, I'm huffed up on Adderall, so I could just think anything was good. Fucking marshmallow. I can't wait to figure out what happened to him. Microwave grill? This is what I mean. Not, and I hate it because this could actually be like a pretty cool like idea. If you can get something in a microwave that makes it feel like it's grilled. But no notes, no nothing. Um, lab tested for bag, for bag welling on Nantucket summer nights. Is Jeff Bagwell in Nantucket? Playing wiffle ball or something? French press. Okay. Is that what this is? Coffee machine? Ow! Paper cut. Got so many of them. What's up, Dave? Dylan here. Long time bar story. A bit of fans since Milton tossed my first shipment into unboxing uh, 11, but I'm not a quitter. I threw it away. Tossed my bit. Uh, these luxury sheets. Ooh, I'm a big sheet guy. Egyptian, perfect for your newfound um, opulence. We also donate 10% of proceeds to cancer care in honor of my mom. Hope you enjoy it. I'm a huge sheet guy. Huge sheet guy. I take my sheets seriously, so let's see what we got here. French press linen experts. I'll give it a shot. I'll report back. Ooh, is there more? What is this? What is going on in here? By the way, remember the pillow? that I thought was very good. I used those sheets and the sheets were good. What's happening? He's here. He's here, but that thing don't work. Yeah. We're being told the marshmallow marshmallow is here, but it's like, we can't, nothing works. It's like, it, we, oh, there we go. It's a 
DM. What? Search? Yeah, but that won't do it. It's got to be, uh, no, it's got to be, it's the other one, it's this. Mm -hmm. But that's like not react. Oh, it just goes to the back. I don't know what's going on. You may have to fucking, uh, we can try to do a quick <laughs> shutdown restart again. Tell him to send a request because it might. Pop hey, Marshmallow, up. if you're out there, send a request. I don't know. It might gonna... pop up in your comment feed that he can. He I don't can... think so. I think we got to send it. And this thing don't work at all. It's like that button's legitimately busted. And try it one more time. But it just like points at you when it does it. It says 52. Yeah. It like unless I have fat fingers. Yeah. It just goes back. It's like such a fucking. It's is your? An, it's an Instagram issue. It's the same thing on your phone. It is. It's just a. It's no. What we were talking about with like the the other streams, like it's it's not working. But I could press it before. Oh well, he couldn't get it before. Now there's more people on. It's just a shitty product right now. All right. Uh, was the lane. We try to get him. I know we can't fucking figure it out. It's weird how that one button can't be pressed. And this is how I get distracted and get fucking a cockroach in my face. Overnight exfoliating treatment. Ooh, somebody taking a shit on Jack's pizza. Don't hate that. I st Worm receipts? You mean worms in there? What is this? No. What is this? Worm? Is it? You say worms, I start getting fucking nervous. Handy hacks. Here we go. No, we got them? No questions. Yeah, it's just that's the one button that can't be pressed. They said if you click on his name. Uh, how do you fucking find his name? You. That's the thing you gotta do. Uh, Who's that? Is that him? No, He's, he would have to comment for the name to do that. He has. Oh. Undisputed? What does that mean? Undisputed hashtag. Hey, check out these patented hats called Handy Hats. They have pockets on the inside to put keys. What? Pockets on the inside? Oh. What? Uh, who comes up with that concept, huh? Hand, at Handy Hats. We're trying to wear a little. We're trying to get marshmallows still. I'd say the odds are like 4% at this point. Dave Portnoy, the horse. Brave Hearts? Okay. It seems like something I'd like. Custom socks. Wear the rear. What is this? Brave Hearts, a horse thing? Trail to zero. Ride. Trail to zero. Ride to end veteran suicide. Listen, you know we are big on that. We have, and this fucking smoky thing. Uh, zero Blog 30, a big part. This hair, my, speaking of hair, fucking, my hair is a fucking disaster. I think you're just going to go all according to getting fucking in there, too. I got to do something about that. I think I just got to stop eating. Too old to do anything. I just got to stop fucking eating. I've been having carbone every night. Every night. Just deliver it now every night. Ooh. Ooh. What is this? What do we got here? Shirt? Yep. What is this shirt? Launch a stone from the earth into your home. That's kind of fucking cool. All right. We're going to get cut off. Go. Ooh, there we go. Put this there so that doesn't fall. Tell him to comment one more time and I'll watch for it. All right. Marshmallow, if you're still out there, comment one more time. We're going to try to do this a different way now and click on your name because the normal button doesn't work. Like, we can't press the add button. Dear Dave, my name is Jody Destano. I run a small family-owned seafood business in Neptune, New Jersey, right down the street from Pete and Elvis. Shout out Pete and Elvis. My father opened it 40 years ago. We've been working together the past 10 years. This is getting sad. He suddenly passed away in August and left everything to me. Fast, past few months have been very difficult dealing with everything. Want to thank you for your pizza reviews and unboxing and make me laugh. And I really needed that recently. Keep up the good work, Jody. The Who's Your Daddy shirt is our Father's Day shirt that we give out every year to customers. What's the name of this place? Did she say the name of the place? Oh, here it is. 
Who's your daddy? Jody and Jody's Fishery. Now that's someplace that you can fucking support. We'll go with that. See, those are the stories I'm talking about. That's, oh, you're going to support, you're going to do this. That's why we're fucking doing it. That's why we're fucking doing it. So if you're in that area, go support these people. Wickles hat. All right. Cool. Ah, uh, shit, Shavir International? Shavir. Never heard of it. Still unboxing. What? Oh, pinata? Looks like we got a pinata. Pizza pinata. Oh, this is where they do it backwards. I'm catching on, right? No. What? Shopmsinger.com. Not backwards. Backwards when you put it. I guess I'm not catching on. Hey, keep it going. Kind of weird how the one time I thought I caught on to it, I did not catch on to it. What is this? Dear Dave, stay cozy, live comfy, M. Singer. Blanket? Just straight blanket and some t shirts. Blanket and t shirts, M. Singer. Looks like a stitchery. Looking around, we're, we're making some pretty good fucking headway here. Life Aid Beverage. Come on, this is one that I shouldn't probably even open. The odds of these people have a no million and one. Million fucking one. Like I said, a million of fucking one. Shouldn't even open. I, I don't want to risk it. If they have a note, it's like, oh, don't be a dick, but you can sense it a mile of fucking one. It's not even reading the note, although we've had some pretty fucking touching stories today. JB Cattle. For some reason, I love hats like this. Like the cattle. My head's a little bit cut off on the tube. JB Cattle. This unboxing get formal offer of half interest in a partner with JB Cattle. Look at this. Own a fucking cattle company. I'll wear the fucking hat. Um, the bull. I know you're a huge sports fan, and the bull is named just. What do you mean, the bull? Oh, they want me to partner with a bucking bull. The unboxing. Unboxing is a formal offer of half interest as a partner with JB Cattle Company on one of our bucking bulls. I know you're a huge sports fan. The bull is named just for that. The bull is the great Bambino. His tag number is 643. What does that even fucking mean? We root for the bull to, like, kill people? I'm in on that. Can I put, like, my guys, like Nate Dog? Hey, Nate Dog, go, read the, go fucking ride the great Bambino and get fucking stomped on. Because if I can, I'm in. Right? Dog with a f fucking top hat. Dog with a top hat. Oh, it's gonna be alcohol. Top hat alcohol or something. I'm already into it. No, glasses. Barrel dogs. Ooh, this hat's something. It's like a fucking Edelman hat or something. Like, super hippie hat. I put it on and I'd sweat my fucking face off. This is heavy as balls. This has to be... Oh, see, smart. Because I, I don't know what this is, but they got the picture of me and the bean on there, and that's how you fucking do it. We're still trying to get marshmallows. This thing just doesn't work. We pressed go live with marshmallow a hundred times. It just won't work. Oh, baby. Look at all these fucking... What is this? A pizza cookie. We got a fucking pizza cookie with my mug showing on it. We got... Uh, fucking Davy Daytrade Global. We got an unboxing fucking shirt. Holy moly, these cookies. Chicks in the office. What company is this? Gotta give them a shout out for all this work. Please enjoy. Uh, this sometimes I fucking, it looks like a kid's fucking project. Uh, Jacksonville, Florida. Cenotis? C-I-N-O-T-T-I-S Bakery. Local bakery. Thanks for all the laughs. Shout out to our favorite um, podcast. Chicks in the office. Pardon my take. Hopefully this brightens your day. Say hello to Randolph. Kyla Reardo. Cenotos Bakery. C-I-N-O-T-T-I-S Bakery. I guess I could have looked on the package. Sometimes, you know, you get in it, you just kind of forget. Thank you. 
Very nice, very sweet. Uh, we're making pretty good progress. What are we at, 9.30? I'm sorry, Mar I don't know, marshmallow is our fault, I guess. We tried to add you like 10 times, it just says can't add them every time. I don't, our fault, it's gotta be Instagram's fault, right? This sure made me look fat, maybe. I gotta stop eating, I just have to stop eating. I, you know, I've said this, a Nintendo controller? Your custom controller for Xbox? Is this even for me? Something tells me that it's for me. No, it is, Sir da it actually says Sir David Portman, just a controller. Barstool edition? What does that fucking mean? This is gonna be custom? Yup, I think it is. Ooh, that's pretty badass. Xbox, is that what Big Cat's playing with Duggan? Is he playing Xbox? Maybe mm -hmm. give him this. Play with a fucking custom Barstool joystick. That's pretty fucking fire. Glad I went all the way through with this. Um, what was I just gonna say? I wish I knew when quarantine was over. I've said this, like, is it gonna be three months? Because then I'll eat like a pig for the next two and then just stop eating. I'll fast myself. I'll have fucking a thousand milligrams of Adderall and fucking Coke every day to thin out. Just let me know. Because if it's two weeks, I gotta stop now. If it's three months, then I'm not gonna see anybody. I'll fucking eat like a horse. I'll just fucking go ham on the drugs when it's time. Kids show. I don't recommend that. That's my diet. I don't recommend it for anybody out there. It's game day, bitches. Okay. Something else in there? No. Disinfectant. We going. We opening. Uh, Dave P. Hmm. Cross out the name. Glitter. No. Uh, okay. Jerry Gerard Polar since night. What a fucking interesting hat that is. Dave, I take photos. All of our. Wait, I take photos. All are in my hats. Would you take some? Me too? What? Dave, I take photos all over in my hats. Would you take some too? Okay, dude. Here, screenshot it, screenshot it. Pow, there it is, got it. I will not take your hat with me on trips though, if that's what you're asking. Couches, Cedarworks. I like pink. What is this? A lure? A driver, a lure. This seems like, again, young page views. What we got here from Jesse, Vancouver, Washington. Glitter bomb. Glitter bomb. Glitter bomb for both. Glitter bomb. You? See ya. Glitter bomb. Ooh. Uh, oh. Yeah, we're making some progress. Down there. I see another glitter bomb in the works. Looper golf. Welcome to Looper Golf, Chris. Thank you. You will find treats, okay? The Navy and all of our best sellers. What are we? What are we looking at? Looper Golf. Ooh, I kind of like the hats. Hats are kind of fire. Looper, Looper. The olive is kind of fire. I'll go with the fucking olive. I think all of, ooh, interesting material too on the hat. I kind of fucking like it. These are actually pretty fucking sick hats. I don't know how they look on me, but they are fucking cool hats. I don't have a great, like, head for hats, so I'm not on the best. Uh, Mora. Ooh, Mora with a whole ton of pictures of her dogs, it appears. El Prez, my name is Mora Carlacci. Business is Carlacci Custom Art. I am self-run out of Scranton, Pennsylvania. Yes, like the office. I mean, I was already saying like the office before, even she did. And I hand paint anything my customers can think of on glassware, clothes, canvases. My son, Edward, has always been a huge Barstool fan. Introduced me to you while he and his girlfriend, Kelly, watch your unboxings. They helped me with this, this idea. I hope you enjoy this one of a kind glass made just for you. P.S. Reach out if you want, ever want a custom Randolph piece. And then a bunch of pictures of like dogs and kids and 
I guess, oh, so she's showing how her like drawings are, the actual picture to the drawing. Pretty cool. Let's see what she drew for me. Oh, muscles, muscles, muscles marinara. All right, listen, El Prez, it's a cool mug. People have said sometimes that I, I can have like a big ego. I'm not this cool looking. Like even, <laughs> even I know that. Like yeah, the leather jacket and I do wear that. But I mean, that guy fucks. This guy fucks your face off right there. I love it, I'll go with it. But I know, thank you, thank you. Let's put that, oh. I thought that was like a giant. I don't know why I threw that back there. Got a bunch of stuff lost in here. Fragile, fragile. Sports and home. Weapon? Yeah, weapon. Probably a weapon. Yep, weapon. Two weapons. Sleepy Hollow Ambulance Corpse. Like the Headless Horseman. Okay. Is that like a real place? FR box. Lovely. Something. Dip. Then is a dick. Chocolate dick. I'm guessing chocolate dick. What do you guys think? I'm thinking chocolate dick. Let's see if I got my chocolate dick radar on. And chocolate dick, chocolate dick. We've been boxing a long time and you can see the chocolate dicks coming. Roof deck season. Next question. I right, listen. Let's fucking get going with that. We already got these. I don't throw those right back with a paint. These are all the fucking loosey goosey down here. We just got a mess of goosey goosey shit. I'm almost causing my own mess. What the fuck's going on in here? International standard. This is overseas. me curious it's from yeah this is a customs declaration from ireland it says chocolate but it certainly fucking doesn't sound like chocolate dave no it is chocolate belgium chocolate maybe dear dave big fan of barcel love everything you guys do i even started following american sports so i can understand the content here are some treats from ireland i hope you like them some content of premier league football would be good Looks like a fucking Cadbury egg he sent me. He sent me a Cadbury egg from Ireland? I can just walk to fucking CVS and get a, Cad get a Cadbury egg. Is Cadbury like Ireland or something? This guy's loading me up on Cadbury eggs. Now this, I have no fucking clue. Weird. Thank you, but like, I mean, I don't... Does he think we can't get Cadbury eggs here? Cobb County Chiefs. What's that? Baseball team? Hey, I'm in Ireland. Whoa, what the f All right, what's going on here? This picture kind of freaked me out. Like, I don't know what that was doing in there, but it gave me the heebie-jeebies. Cadbury... I don't see the connection at all. Like, I like the shirt, but I want nothing to do with anything because of that picture. That was fucking weird. Hooker Custom Harness Ink. Like, hooker as in you fuck, or hooker as in something totally different. That was fucking weird. I don't want that have to do with anything. Oh, masks. Like, ninja masks. Save lives. 
I am in the mask game now. It took me a little while to do it. And now I just fucking will absolutely give anybody a dirty look who's not wearing a mask. Like, dude, what the fuck are you doing? Like, you're not wearing a mask? I'm wearing a mask. You think I want to wear a mask? Put a fucking mask on. But I've only been wearing a mask for like a day. Game changer. Underwear. We'll go. Game changer. Oh, listen. Everyone knows I'm a high-end fucking uh, Dolce & Gabbana underwear guy. But I'll give that a shot. I'm being loosey-goosey. This is how you end up getting a fucking animal. I feel like this is... Nubilees or Wizard? I don't know what that is. I still don't know what that is. I'm all the way in here and I don't know what it is. Is it in here? What is this? Weed? I don't... I don't know. I don't know what this is. Sorry, I'm sure it's great. I just don't know what it is. Kendall Scott? Oh, first of all, hey, Bradley Cooper, TB12, Dave, go, look at this fucking, now that is artwork. That's fucking artwork. It's fucking beautiful. Um, sorry, only had pink, was going to use blood, but ran off one bite. Ooh, big time note. Saw you wearing that ugly Auburn jersey the other day, and although you never look bad, we think the red and black would heighten your sex appeal. Come to the UGA Bama game, 19th, we'll show you a good time. Go Dawes, Kendall, Megan, Regan. Listen, I'll fucking throw on a dog shirt. Who is it? R. Smith? No fucking clue who that is. But we'll do it. We'll fucking... I like the football shirts. I, I kept the... I have, what, A&M, Auburn, and now Georgia. All right. We'll fucking go it. There it is. Football shirts, 100%. Oh, this one's not a real one. The other ones were like, had the shoulder pads. This is more wear to a game type situation, which I'm fine with. Uh... Quinn Lewin I can't pronounce his name. Quinn Hyannis? Quinn in Ridgewood, Jersey. Something, something. Quinn Quinn. Is it, we got knives? What do we got here? We got a tough opening, I'll tell you that right now. Yeah, I think we're going to get some knives. No. Chocolate. Fudge. Sweet in every sense since 1947. This is an envelope for ants. Zoolander. I mean, what the... In the middle of an unboxing, this is something. Enjoy the Eat Me from the Kiwi Hyannis. And Hyannis, I'm not a huge fudge guy, but it looks fucking delightful. We'll save that and eat that later. I'm going to be so fucking fat. What's going on in here? What's going on in here? I don't know. We're going to find out in a fucking second. Oop. Oop. Did I rip this? Cool. Kids, it is a kid's show. You hang out. It's actually not a bad sign for the kids. Like, for a kid's shirt. Jolly Rancher. Are these going to be weed? No. What are these? Cafe. What's going on, guy? I hope your finger's feeling better. Tw oh, shit. This is what I'm talking about. I hope your finger is feeling better in that near-death encounter with a double blade knife. My name is JJ Gartner. I'm 12 years old. I'm a 12-year-old girl from northern Wyoming. Every night my parents and I watch your unboxing and pizza reviews. I find it funny that you say kids show, but then right after you curse. <laughs> I hope you like this parcel logo I drew for the kids show. And also, fucks Jack, no disrespect. Listen. Kids are going to find out about the F word one way or the other. They might as well find out from me. Then they can be the cool kid strolling down in fucking sixth grade elementary school be like, hey, Jimmy, fuck you. And that's like, oh, badass kid show. I don't recommend that, JJ. Don't do that if your parents tell you not to. It is a kid show. You get a double rip there. Sweatshirt. Does that work? Is that backwards? Thrift. What the fuck? I, this guy did this. I think this guy tried to do this. I think this guy tried to do this so it would be backwards. He just made it so he can't see it anyways. There's no way to see this anyway. Is it the Vikings? What do we got here? Oh, the Mamba. It's kind of a fire fucking shirt. We're going to have like a Mamba package. We got that poster that can go with. Someone's getting the fucking money. this going to say? Dave, my name is... Thri All right, so it's... it he, At Thrift Life. T H R one F T L one F three small vintage shop out of Duluth, Minnesota. 
said he put a bad boy shirt in here too. I don't know what that means. That's like, that's a bad boy shirt? I didn't know that. Throat's starting to give it on me. We just play through. The lot of talking. These things are all, is this just a fucking book? I just get a fucking book. Coloring book of dicks. You just draw dicks? You just get dicks. Eat a bag of dicks, the coloring book. Oh, it's like penis heads and you just fucking draw them and shit. There's like a majestic dick. Who, ha like, does somebody like buy that, do that? Or is it always like a gag gift and this is a weird thing. What the fuck is this? You'll probably just use your brains and pull the pull, the pull tab instead of... Slicing that fucking thing up. What the fuck? It's a lot of work for whatever this little thing is. Narwhal. Oh, narwhal. I mean, it's, it's, it's from obviously uh, Elf, but I don't, there's no point to send me that with no information. These little packages can really grind you. Video games. Play. See, these little, is this going to even have any sense of anything? Nintendo games? Excite Bike, Mario Brothers, Tomb Raider. All right. I did get a Nintendo. Everybody knows the rules. That's me. Good looking guy. That is a real picture. More art. My gallery is going to be superb. It's just all of me. Pants. Looks like girl leggings. Can I put a note why they sent me girl leggings? Nope. Just girl leggings. And more girl. Outdoor voices? Fuck you. Fuck you, outdoor voices. Total waste of time. Send me girl leggings, nothing down. Hey Dave, hope you enjoy this t-shirt from nothing down. Okay. There it is. At least they put in the fucking note. Handle with care. Double, double. Uh, hey Prez, hope this little piece of history finds its way into your heart. At least enough to bump my name up the list for a video editor job. There's a picture of me slicing. Let's figure out what we got. He's looking for a job, so it should be good. Oh, it's not good. It's a fucking Giants ticket. Is this water mine? I can drink this? All right, quick drink break because I'm like fucking throw time. Hmm. All right, back at it. What's this guy? Yeah, hey, surprises. You've been pooped. Nope, don't want to know, don't care. Okay. What time we got? 10? All right, we're doing good. We, uh, we'll be done by 11. This one actually went longer than I kind of thought. Maybe because we were doing, I thought it didn't look as much, but we're still going kind of strong here. Hey, Prez, heard your one bite has been lacking crispy crust. Preheat oven? What is this, an oven? It's a stone. It's something uh, like a cooking stone. And Emily Herbata, like cooking stone or something. Right. Please handle it. Come on. It's a problem with the glove. My hand, by the way, has not bothered me at all. Pretty solid. Yep, we got some art. Oop. Yeah. Prez, hope you like the painting. Stay safe. Viva. Art Vandal. Art underscore Vandal underscore A. I hope I like the painting too.
One bite. Is it a one bite? It says one bite on the back. Ooh, I can smell it. Ooh. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles have been, like, in vogue. That's pretty fucking cool. I can see that being in, like, a gallery. Like, if, uh, no joke. If you put this in, like, uh, who's my guy? The guy who does the Monopoly. Alex Monopoly. Like, that could look like that would fit in his. He was in the comments earlier. Alex Monopoly, yeah. Did Pete's review it. All right. Well, this thing over here. We got a lot of Uh, art, I think we're gonna have art here. Do not slice artwork, okay? Not gonna slice. I'll just muscle instead. At Rich Sensale. Hey Dave, big fan. I drew, what did you draw? I drew you. How about a shout out to the lids from the Valley Stream? Thanks, bud. You know, all right. <laughs> I'm looking, he's a tattoo artist. Imagine if I got this tattoo. I'm looking at this right now. I think my belly looks terrible. I think I just look like my gut's hanging out. I look like kind of, a good package work and I gotta go both like big dick big gut <laughs> fuck jacks I like the knife this is this is fucking something I, I get would you rather nah, I'd rather probably have a tighter tighter stomach and less dick if I if beggars could be choosers oh work belt yep actually I like this I can use this like, this will probably get worn tomorrow with all sorts of fucking shit. Or not tomorrow, next time we do it. Is this where they do the reverse? Yup, dapper set. Get onto it now. All right. How do you open your dapper set? Not that easy right there. Ow. First time I say it. I fucking haven't hurt my thumb in there. I heard it. Some gloves. I respect that. Dapper socks, tie. I guess dapper set. The purple socks. I always will take socks. Loafers. I was like loafers except loafers. They look like fucking Crocs. They're... <laughs> So this is a look where like flofers to the fucking beach. That's like a very bro -y thing. I can see fucking bros eating this shit up for lunch. Flofers? Definitely. That, uh, what do we got? Is this? This has not been open. Frankie Tartamala, Western Florida. All right. Fucking shit all over me right now. Ooh. Very good hand game. I've been very good with that. I don't want to jinx it, but I have Double, double package. Looks like Star Wars, maybe? There's a cartoon girl with a spectacular ass. Like, look at the ass on that fucking fake girl. And then a Vinny Targula. All right, let's see what we got, Vinny. Muhammad Ali. And again, this girl with the fucking ass. Hey Dave, Barcelona Vinny's an artist. Vinny's the man. Saw the Teddy Atlas piece review. Thought you'd like an all print signed by Vinny. How about a shout out? Instagram, Vinny Art. There you go. IGG. This is like fucking Creed thoughts on there with that fucking thing. IGG.me slash at slash TTWC. Dude, you gotta come up with something a little bit better than that.
Better World Books. This is that. This is just a book. There's nothing in there. I'm not open. TG Sports. USA. Just a straight USA. I'm not gonna take the dogs off of that, but I don't. You can't ever go wrong with a straight USA shirt. Ross Rojigo. Go blue. All right. Makes me feel like I'm not about to get fucking bugged. Culinary butane torch for cooking? I guess. To go blue, I guess, counts as personalization. James Foyer. Ship. Cut there. I probably got about 25 minutes. Whoa. Is this Cheez Its? Oh, this is an old school care package. It's got all my favorites reduced fat Cheez Its, which. What I'm doing now, because I keep saying, I'm getting, hello, Prez, we love your piece of views. My name is, I represent Algacolic Youth Football and Cheer. AYFL, great program, teach our youth. We're a small community in the little known town of Algonac, located in the bottom thumb in Michigan with a population of 4,551 people. All right, this is getting long. Um, and we'll, it's to the bottom. How we... They need people to fundraise. This is long. Uh, and close of youth jersey. Add a little color. Cheese its Kit Kats. Thank you. What does this guy need? I, it's such a long letter. Previous board meeting allowed communities to let, keep their equipment, blah, 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 to help smaller communities. In order to continue, we got to purchase new helmet. I, listen, dude. It, it, I couldn't figure out what you wanted. But I'll fucking throw on a youth football shirt like you read about and try to get some publicity that way. I don't know what, what he, that was such a long letter. I mean, that was like, you were off to war for, I don't know if this is gonna fit. This is not gonna fit. I think I'm gonna get stuck in this t-shirt. There's a good chance this absolutely will not go on me. Am I in this? It's a football shirt, right? Where's the fucking head? Does it not have a head? What the fuck? Is it inside out? What the fuck's going on? There's two? Is there a head? There we go. Oh, no. No chance. There's just no chance. This is not... This is not going on my body. No. No chance. <laughs> I don't know what made me think I could get this on, but I can't. And I can't even fucking come close. So now, now we got skins game. And I should do fucking push-ups, Bagwell. Just so I'm not getting fat, fat shamed out here. Alright. Well, we can go on that. All the way back in the back here. See what we got. Oh, I didn't even know I had more fucking shit right there. I should have just done that. This, listen, I know how the internet works and being caught shirtless when you're not in great shape. Like, oh, nice shirts. I don't know who you are. I don't care what you are. You're getting worn. Is this a strip club? Is that just a strip club? Whatever. You're getting thrown on. It's got to be a strip club. Do not care. Kids show, can't be shirtless. Look. Boop, boop. Can't have that. Used to not have that. Pre-corona. Nope. Because I walked. Thank God that was something. The buttress pillow. I'm all about pillows. I hope there's a note in here so I can give this the time to get Be a B, B, have a note. Buttress pillow, have a note for me. What is this? Is it for your butt? The butt pillow? What is this? Is there a note in here or nothing? No, oh, no, good. For your enjoyment in this time of isolation, butts for all, the buttress pillow. I don't get it at all. It's just a butt pillow? It's just a pillow that looks like a butt? It's just a butt pillow? Is it a sex toy? Or is it just a pillow that looks like a butt? What is this? What does this have to do with the butt pillow? Is 
Is this the cover for the butt pillow? It is. What the? It, listen. And this is like fancy shit. I haven't got a clue what this is all about. It is super soft, though. And I guess you put it in... What is Miami? Ah, listen. Amen to the butt buttress pillow. What 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 a world. What a fucking world. There's a butt pillow. Kuzma. What does that mean? Like the, the Lakers butt? Kuzma. Dave, huge fan. Just wanted to say fuck for any line, fuck jacks. Kuzmo clothing. Okay. Kind of cool logo, cool hat. I should have actually put that on. Hogs, Arkansas. Is that what that is? Arkansas, maybe. Grizzly Man Outdoors. Okay, Grizzly Man Outdoors. This hat, these hats that are like, I would say, you gotta be a cool guy to wear. Traditionally, I cannot pull off. And the tradition continues. And the tradition continues. But whatever, it's on. Once it's on, it's on. Prince. This is my guy, Grutman. I know Miami King Miami owns Prince. And I'm jealous because I want to fucking bring Prince back. And he brought Prince back. And they have cool, cool ass clothing. The old school tennis balls. These are shorts. Polo. T-shirt. This is probably the fire jacket right here. This is probably the one. Oh yeah, I mean this is just, this is just fucking flames. That's fucking flames and light, and we'll do that so I can get into fucking live if it ever reopens. Ooh, super light. This this is like retro style right here. I mean, the hair doesn't do it justice, but that is fucking fire. What is this? Ooh, headbands and wristbands. Oh! Wanna play peanut butter game? I'm gonna be honest. I thought this was a uh, fucking Randolph. <laughs> I thought this was fucking Randolph, not wanna play the peanut butter game. All right. That's what she said. Caitlin Osborne. I don't know how our highlight video is going to be tomorrow because I don't know what we saved, if anything. I like when people like write on cardboard. My boyfriend brought this shirt for the 2019 NFL Draft. He wore it once on a trip with his buddies to Nashville. It's been hanging in the closet ever since. I included a photo of him wearing it in case you need some styling inspiration. P.S. It's been washed. One bite everybody knows the rules. What in the world? Oh, it's Michael Scott. This guy kind of looks like Big Ev a little bit. A little BF vibe to him. An all over print Michael Scott shirt. Yep. I love this, by the way. This, I, and I don't even, looking on YouTube, hate my hair right there. All right. We're going Michael Scott. This is getting into the save pile for sure. All right. Don't know which side's front. I don't know that there is a front, to be totally honest. And by the way, why is the boyfriend only wearing this once? This is almost like a shirt you have to wear every day, right? Thank you. Very nice. Moving right along. This is just a magazine of some sort. Shipped to Scott Portnoy, Wisconsin Department of Travel. If I could take my dick out and fucking piss on this right now, I would. I'm going to give him the benefit of the doubt and open it. But when it comes from the Wisconsin Department of Travel, PR, when it says Scott Portnoy on the name, this is just fucking some ass who didn't do any research. I'm going to get a book on why I should go to fucking Wisconsin. Really? Really? Like I said. Are you fucking kidding me, Wisconsin? Well, hey, hey, Wisconsin, grow up. How do you like that? Hey, Sam Decker, get your fucking state under control. Huh? Fucking losers. Big Cat, you, you called your state. Jaminski, come on, fucking pizza cutter. Wisconsin, fucking Scott Portnoy, grow up. That's why he couldn't fucking win the national championship. What is this? What? 
Dilt Roy, Detroit, Detroit Spring Break, 1976. Who the fuck is going to Detroit in 1976 for Spring Break? Jacqueline Pruna. What? XOXO. <laughs> a knit Dave Portnoy. When you think you've seen it all, you get a knit Dave Portnoy. XOXO. What do we... I don't sell these, just want to make something special. Love Jacqueline. Come say hi on IG, at Jacqueline Lexon. I think I'm getting hit on a lot. And to be honest, if you can make this for me, I'm like ready to go. That's fucking nice. Uh, all right. Mike Lance. The only thing is, what do you do with shit of yourself? You can't like do anything with it. I mean, it's nice, but El Prez has been stoolie since the college days, early 2000s. Here's a shirt from my pizzeria in Wesley, Rhode Island. Victoria, New York, Victoria, New York pizza. Let's just see what it says. Owner, Victoria Pizza. Is that the name of it? Pizza Boys. Of, <laughs> I like that shirt. I actually fucking like that shirt. Now, you know what? Fuck it. I like the Michael Scott shirt more, but these people literally sent it. Probably get a little shine with the pizza guy wearing a fucking pizza shirt, so I'll do it. I don't like this shirt more than the fucking Michael Scott, but that's not the name of the game here, right? So there you go. The pizza boys getting the pizza guy to wear it. Joey Fracher. All right, that's the end of Do Not Bend. Okay, Joey, just relax. Everyone fucking chill out. We're not bending it. You see, I've opened a million fucking packages. Oh, it's a sign thing? Again, it's like, how do you manage this? This isn't, listen, I will sign fucking anything people want, sending it randomly in the unboxing in a million packages, find smiles inside, is probably not the way to do it because we're in the middle. Like, there I am, there I am. That picture, hall of fame. Oh, we're paused, poor connection, I'll wait. All right, we're back on Insta. Uh, Hall of Fame picture. But you, the signing thing is tough to do in real time. All right, that's gone. A lot of little guys here. What do we got for time? 10.14. We're making progress. I'd say 10.45 would be my guess of being... This package reeks of animals. No, it says Jason Bachrock. Nothing on it. I got a little confused. Oh, that is. What the fuck? What are we getting out here? There's a picture of a lady. I don't know what the fuck that is. I don't know if I'm supposed to know who this lady is. Zilla Bing. What? Am I missing a joke here? That's all that's in here. I don't know what it is. Does anyone know what that is? I have no idea what that is. Jason Burr. I, I literally no idea what I just opened. I don't know if they're just pranking that girl or I, next question, Boston. I have no idea what I just opened. If I missed an inside joke, I missed it. Ha the Sunday, selfie Sunday. <laughs> Selfie Sunday, next question. I put it on, it's a good fucking thing, but it's a complicated hat to put on. Good hat though, Selfie Sunday. Uh, shout out stats, Paul and Courtney. I may almost have, have the first sneeze in the history of the boxing when this um, came up there. Not bad to do a million fucking boxings and never sneeze. It's in my system. It is, I have a sneeze on deck. Pizza, hey Dave, huge fans, love the pizza reviews on boxing. Hopefully the pizza pouches come in handy. Oh, pizza. Oh, and Big League Chew. Everyone knows I fucking love Big League Chew. Original. Let's fucking... I don't want to go... Ball game. Ball game. Ball game. This thing's fucking big. Muscles. Ball game. All right. That should open right there, boys. That should open right there. A lot of shit in this thing. A lot of shit in this thing. I don't know what's going on here. Hemper? Hemper? What's hemper? Is hemp? What is fucking hemper? Cutlery? What is this? 
Do I know what Hemper is? What the fuck is this? Filter. Oh, it's all like, duh, duh. Hey, hey. You know what Hemper is? Fucking hemp, you fucking moron. Huh. Gotta get rid of the tobacco. Not tobacco, kid show. That's big weed chew. Don't do tobacco. Kid show. The Bermans. Oops. It's a miracle that the way I'm just fucking slinging and jiving and moving and ducking and weaving and bobbing and all that jazz, it's a miracle I still have two fucking box cutters. A miracle. Bermans. Oh, wedding invite. My fiance and I have been fans. Of, I'm going to have to go to a wedding. I'm just going to have to. I will not do... I've taken a stand on Zooms. Every night I go home, I have a... I, I'm not sure. I have a lot of people being like, join my Zoom, join my Zoom. No, not join fucking Zooms. Uh, fucking Dana Beak and join your Zoom. I will go to a wedding. I promise you I will go to one random person's wedding who invites me. Catch your breath, I almost died. Chelsea Sternberg, Richard Berman, Guilford Yacht Club. All right. You're going to be on the knot planning a honeymoon in Nantucket. Woo, get in touch with me. I'll tell you fucking where to go. Best place in the world. Best place in the world. Kit Kats. I'm going to be so fucking fat. Oh, you were heavy. Aren't you a heavy little guy? Aren't you a little fucking heavy guy from Sioux Falls, South Dakota? What is that? I don't know what's going on. This guy, does it say anything weird? I'm a little fucking apprehensive here because I can't tell what that logo is. No, it's from the guy's company, it looks like. And there's a note. Okay, peanut butter. We hope you guys enjoy Fookin Nuts. Okay, just nuts. Peanut butter. Fookin peanut butter. I bet this shit's really good. I feel like if you get anything like butter or anything from South Dakota, North Dakota, it's fucking awesome. Sneaker pots. I don't want that. Oh, they put like weed in the sneaker? Enjoy your first sneaker pot. Yes, the succulent is real. I make these ceramic sneaker planters out of my garage. You are a plant dad. Laugh out loud. So it's a real plant. I'm a plant dad. That's kind of fucking cool. That's really cool, actually. What a fucking unique idea. You see so much shit you would never imagine. A million years doing this. It's like, what more can people send me that I haven't seen? Guess what? A fucking sneaker plant. Again, I, for me, I, I, this works for a lot of people. I may be a little old, but that's if you're like, a, like KFC is like a sneaker fucking head. Could be good for him. It's pretty fucking cool. Genius. And I know. Here's the thing. It's 1020. We got, what do we got? 10,000, 12, so 22,000 people. And I got to finish strong because I've said this a million times. It's, well, a million, 13 times. It's the luck of the draw when you get your package unboxed. So it's like I could have energy towards the end as much as I do in the beginning because they, unless you're sending me like a dead fish head. But if you send something like that, I gotta have some energy. All right. Taylor Brown, Arizona. It's crazy too how these packages come from fucking every which way. Thank you for sacrificing your hands, mental state. Yep, I know you have a ton of hats, but it's all we do, custom hats. Whoa, this is a fucking wild hat. Hooligan house. I mean, not necessarily, I'm gonna say my style, but <laughs> this is a fucking hat, all right? This is a fucking hat, all right? Bling, bling. Bling, bling goes the hat, hat. Bling. <laughs> I don't hate it how it looks on me. I should like this hat on me, but I don't hate it. I don't fucking hate it. I should hate it. No offense to this guy, it's just not my size. But what the fuck? It's just a pinata. It's just a pinata. Gay mad. Little gay mad. Hey, 
Okay, Pat, there you go. I got a bunch of Playboys. I got nothing wrong. If you like dick, you like dick. No judgment here. Be careful, Dave. Tone Jones. That's why you gotta be careful because you're gonna fucking scare the fuck out of yourself. What the fuck is a stuffed box? Is that what this is? Good luck charm for trading. Wow. I'm not, I, I'm not like a dead animal, guys, but he means well here. I guess you can think this is. In all my luck, this thing will jump out and bite me. Not my style. I know some people like it. Not my style. I'll show it. I mean, look how cute that is. I wish he was alive. Not my style. Is that a deer? I generally root for the animals. Like, I wish whoever killed that, that thing latched onto your larynx and killed you. But I guess he meant well. See? Yips. Ampsilis. Hey, Prez, smelling salts to keep you energized. All right, I don't mind smelling salts, to be totally honest. Wardman, certified sports breaks. I feel like that animal's now looking at me and being like, I thought you were an animal guy. I didn't know, dude. I'm just opening the fucking presents. Don't get mad at me. I didn't fuck. If it was up to me, you would have killed whoever killed you. Bill's Mafia. Oh, the Pinto Ron guys. What does it say? It's got to be Pinto Ron with the ketchup, right? Sabres. Saber breaks, Razzies, giveaway. Bunch of shit. All right, keep it going. Oh, the backwards fucking thing there. Mount, is that backwards? Mount Mila? It's gonna be like protein. Do we just get proteined? I think we may be getting proteined. A little pain there in the knuckle. No, I see a shirt. Oh, no, it's some sort of lacrosse is this lacrosse mount saint mary's lacrosse all right helmet i thought i was getting fucking protein uh el prez barso uh my name is brian mccarthy right on behalf of mount saint mary's lacrosse right you sending contents social media uh pandemic we're not sure if you're still but if you are shout out would be a tremendous impact you're getting the shout out um stay healthy all right limited edition gold share We'll suit up for Mount St. Mary's. Wait a minute, they have multiple shirts in here, I guess. Although they're saying, they're saying this is limited edition. This thing's gonna be fucking huge. This has to be like a goalie shirt, right? Cause they don't even fucking like wear pads, I don't think. Well, they do, but little. There we go. Here we go. Straight Mount St. Mary's right there. There's your shot. This. Gonna be some art. Oh boy, come on. That hat's growing on me. I'm like missing it. It's like lizard eyes. Wow, lucky I just didn't get a vicious paper cut with the way I did that. Hey Dave, Insta is wowyourmom.com wowyourmom.com and we got a painting here boys we got a painting here looks like i am george washington it would appear the first one i sent broke and the note fell off look at this fucking thing george washington city right there what a fucking world the art that is coming i could create the most oops narcissistic environment of all time, if I just kept fucking putting every, I, like, imagine if no one knew why you had all these paintings. I'm, you're as fucking Napoleon, you're as fucking George Washington, you're as fucking Caesar. Caesar. Is this been already open? Yep. All right. What is this? Martyr? What's martyr? What's martyr? Special? The safe cutting. Okay. I can deal with you. I can deal with you. 
thought this was going to be a bug. Nope, just safe cutting a uh, martyr. So that must be a type, listen, type of fucking box cutter. Well, oh, how's this fucking thing work? I can't even figure it out. It's that safe. So safe, I'll probably cut my fucking hand off. I'll wait to figure it out. That one's a little confusing. That's like a big time fucking box cutter. Martyr, we'll see how you pan out. Ooh. KO Mike Tyson's punch out. We used to sell these back in the day. Uh, Dave, this shit is fragile. Chill with the knives. Okay. I mean, I'm opening 3,000 packages. If I go slow, we'll be here till fucking 2040. So I'm just trying to get a little pep. I'm not like trying to cut my hands off. You know what I'm saying? Vintage smoking accessories at high gear vintage includes are we 70 jars mercury wood a bunch of stuff i thought they was getting a smoking jacket ow i just hit myself in the stomach so it's like stuff like this all smoking accessories not a big smoker though What do we got? There's a note, but I couldn't read it, and it looks like there's ice or something in here. Four pat puff. Tape. Heating, boom, boom. What is this fucking thing? Ryan Cheryl. No idea. Just a hat. Oh. Corduroy, the hat you need for hunting with all the weapons. One color hat. Yeah, no, a big hunter guy. The hat is fucking electric factory hat. Can I wear it as like a poser? Like, oh, I'll hunt, but not really. Like, I'll give the gun to the dog. Alpha Sigma. Little frat action. You gotta give him credit for using the pink Whitney box. Santa Booze. Alpha Sigma. Their fucking pledge class. Alpha Sigma Dow Tau. And we switch. And there you go. Get it. Send the hat away. What do we got here? Team Stussy. These type boxes still kind of make me a little nervous. This Stussy is like a brand that's come back. Team, team issued, team issued. Stussy. These hats I know will not look good on me. We'll give it a shot. Go with gray. I don't think we've worn a gray hat yet. This hat actually is not that hat on me. Come on, buttons. I'd be stunned if I can pull this hat off the way it looks. What's this, what is Team Stussy? Actually, it's softer than I thought. See, the big, but I kind of am pulling it off. Give credit to my head there for having it through. Dave Barstool Prez, Joseph Schmalocker, New Jersey. All right, these packages, everyone knows your unboxing things that I stink at these. Jersey of some sort. Huh, what is this? Dave, my name is Andrew Revitz, and I'm a committed D1 ice hockey player going to your University of Michigan. And I close a game worn autographed jersey of mine from my Banton travel career. Frame it. <laughs> Frame it. Frame it. Frame it. Frame you. 
frame your shirt and remember you have it when I get drafted and go to the show. Let me tell you something, Andrew Rabbit. Like, I'm fucking rooting for you, dude. I am. But, like, Kevin Hayes, who's, like, the best player in the NHL, sent me, like, a game-worn jersey. It's a, in a pile of fucking junk right now. So I don't know that I'm going to, like, be saving that. Um, Dimmick Dairy. We already got Dimmick Dairy. We already did that. Great ice cream, by the way. Old Rose sending me something? What's... Oh, this is... Wait a minute. I don't know what this is. Mike Mike Welker, the worst to ever do it, sent me something from Old Rope. What the fuck are you doing, Welker? Why is Welker sending me an Old Rope shirt? Lock her up? What are you fucking Carol Baskin? Why are you sending me this, Welker? It's not a bad shirt, actually, from Old Rope, but, like, why is... Why, Mike Welker does things in a mysterious way. And when I say mysterious, poorly. Oh, we got... Whoa, this fucking thing's heavy. Is this... Oh, got to get that out of there. Uh, the Hayes Corp. The nice Flyers jersey, too. What Fuck off the pepper. Um, this. So, this makes no sense. All right. This right here, it, it says LT56 Lawrence Taylor. Yes, the real LT. As in, like, the best defensive football player of all time. What is this going to be? I was set up like a motherfucker. That. This thing is so fucking heavy. It's like art, but it weighs a million fucking pounds. I forget what interview that was from LT when, oh, I mean, I love you, LT, when they tried to set you up. He's like, I was set up like a motherfucker. This thing, what the fuck is this? By the way, one of the best things, I gotta show it, I don't know where it is, where is that one bite light thing? That's like one of the best things we have. Your apartment. This, this feels like, I don't know what we're dealing with here. LT, what did you fucking send me? This thing's fucking heavy and unmanageable. Is it LT? It's fucking Derek Jeter. And it's like a hologram of some sort. First of all, I'm a Red Sox guy, so I mean, that's a little weird. Is it gonna be LT? Is this guy like pranking me? He sent me a giant, is this a Tesla? What are you doing, LT? Budweiser? The Jets? Hey, Bruins, there we go. There's one. We got one that I'd keep. I guess we can raffle these off. Saquon Barkley leaping over somebody. Chiefs 49ers Super Bowl. There is no rhyme or reason what LT. LT may have been on the wild stuff when he sent this. And then a Trump dollar bill. Why do I think, oh, there's more. <laughs> there's more. Fucking shit's heavy. LT. Oh, that, am I really supposed to believe Lawrence Taylor picked this random assemblage of stuff out and sent it to me? With absolutely no rhyme or reason to why any of these are sent at all, like zero. North Carolina is. The, did LT go to North Carolina? I think he did. Yeah. Wait. Does it say Lawrence Taylor on it? 98? Maybe? That could be signed Lawrence Taylor. And then... A, I, think he's got, I think he's got a Brady in here on the box. Fucking LT. How fast 
they make this fucking Brady one. This, it, first of all, when you look at these things, it like, it blinds the fuck out of you. It's like translucent. All right, so here, you never know. Like who, who at this company is like, let's send, I think that is a sign Lawrence Taylor. I think. And, and this, I mean, how fast did they, this Stephen Shea would die for. I mean, that's pretty fucking sick. I hate it, but it's pretty fucking sick. You should just fucking send that. How about LT being like it's from me and not sending me LT, except unless you say they're cartoons. That was weird. Welcome to Lawrence Taylor's world. Stephen Shea would kill for that. Right, let's whip through these fucking Lawrence Taylor, man. Yeah, I don't really believe you sent those, dude. Greatest player of all time on defense. What is this? Prez, big fan, South Dakota. Wear this the next time on Car Tucker Carlson. I mean, probably not going to wear whatever this is. What is this? What? 26? We win or lose, we still booze. Okay. Fucking LT. I can't get over that LT thing. What do we got here? A book? We getting books? Moisturizer, hand mask. That's nothing. Something else. We'll give you a shot because you look like good packaging. Oh, now I'm getting a little bit. No, it's just a shirt. Just a shirt. Oh, it's like a Pizza Jaws shirt. That's kind of fire. That's actually really fire. I like that a lot. We have the pizza one bite where he's biting the pizza, so it's actually not too dissimilar. Maybe actually is our concept, but no, I don't hate this. I like ours, no offense, a little bit more now I'm looking at it. Read the note. Thanks for the entertainment. Hope you like the pizza shark koozie hand sanitizer. Love Kristen. Something else, Doylestown, Pennsylvania. All right, I just lose a, yep. Oh no, I lost the, I'm great with the fucking. I must just have way more room at this table because I lose, no disrespect, cocksucker. Is this supposed to be Jack's? I don't know. Established. Flip the switch, flip the switch, flip the switch, so flip the switch, all right? Yeah, yeah, I'm making progress. You are me. So we got like two or three more runs in us. What time is it? 10.40, yeah, it'll be over before 11. Jared Dillon fan club? Lee Rachel, I think they're going to play a prank on Jared Dillon, whoever Jared, do you know who Jared Dillon is? It, it's Lee, a big fan. Your pizza reviews never, uh, have never made me want to eat a pie so bad. That's what she said. Wanted to share some cool mutual mercy uh, and music. Jay Dillon. So this is just a dude who plays music or something. This is like a guy. See that guy? That's like, what's he doing? The Michael Scott fucking improv class? Does anyone know who that is? Knife. Yep. Knife, weapon. Those are just one tons. We don't open those anymore. No point in doing the uh, one click thing from Amazon, even though we need their stock price to go up. But they're all the same and no notes. So we don't even open them. No note. We don't. This is bad news. This is definitely bad news. I've been doing this game long enough to know I got bet when I got bad news on my hand. What are you, dude? What are you? No? Oh, just like kick field goals and shit? What is this? Is this a toy? Oh. Maybe for, yeah. Oh, it's it's for Randolph or 
No, Randolph is the only one who really needs. He's got the big tank. He's my firstborn. Was this Z? Zazzle customer service. Also, will not have the most of them. But Zazzle's custom, right? Are you mean custom shit? Whoa. I don't like that fucking thing right there. Like, I don't like when it has like a double thing because it makes me think someone's trying to bite me. Nope, just a mug. Just a mug. World's best boss, Dave Portnoy. Thank you. I appreciate that. Oh, fuck you. This is heavy. Oh, fuck you. This is heavy. Fuck you. Sorry, kids show, but it's fucking heavy. Fucking heavy. Woo. Rectech grill. The grill, clearly, and it's fucking a heavy motherfucker. How much does it cost to send this? Holy shit. Yeah, it says 40 pounds. No wonder it's fucking heavy. What is this? It's like Rec Tech Grills Ultimate Blend Premium Hardwood Pellets. There's two 40 pound bags in here of fucking pellets. Why would you send fuck? I like that half belt. It's kind of like fired his bull. Bull with the ooh and the red. We'll go with that. But why would you send? Right now, I've been doing it for three hours. Fine. I am resting on my leg 80 pounds. Not sweating, not freaking, just doing the damn thing. But fuck, man. My 80 pounds. And 80 pounds now on the ground. Okay. Pop, pop. Potato. I see a golden potato. I'm not picking it up. Uh, let's see what we got here. Nope. Make sure I'm not doing coffees. Nope. Photograph, yes. Ask me anything, Dave Portnoy, yes. Let's go. We're nearing the end here, people. The bitter end of the Unboxing 13. Featuring Marshmallow, except not. All right, how do you open this? This guy, this way. Don't cut yourself. You've done so good, Dave. You're going to have no injuries tonight. You can rest and heal those hands till the next one. But don't don't lose concentration. Games are, whoop, games are won and lost in the final fucking plays. Every play matters. Every package matters. All right? Come on. Pizza tray, I think. I'm getting a lot of these. They're all nice. Fuck Jacks at Parker Skirta and Tables. Whoa, that's actually a good one. All right, Frankie. Good material, too. That may be the new one. That one's pretty fucking nice. I don't know how to choose, and I can't keep them all. I don't have room. Attention, ask me anything. Okay, is this kind of like ask the internet? Oh. Now I have uneven pudding because I have 80 pounds of like pellets beneath me. Hey, I'm so happy you received the game. Huge Barstool fan, I can't wait to play. It's perfect time. Ask me anything, ultimate social game. I'm sure it's great, but I gotta say, ask the internet. Our game is kind of one I'd want you to buy, but if not, buy both. Pop, pop, pop. Roberto Lopez, Brooklyn, New York. Reminder, package people, if you still want to send, again, we're not asking for them, but if you want to, you want to get your minute, 15 West 27th. That's where new packages go. If you send it to the old place, can't guarantee anything. What do we got here? Negative... 
No, what? Negative by Nori. Looks like someone's packing a gun there. I don't know what that is. Skulls with the face. I'm going to be honest, this guy, this, this is all making me quite nervous. So great. This stuff's great. I love it. I love it. Nothing but great stuff to say about that because uh, this, we already did that. That's just a way to look at your thing. Computer. Ooh, handcuffs. Third precinct. Suffolk County, with all those weapons, you're gonna need this get out of jail free card handcuffs to be used on a bad girl. <laughs> get some, get some, Jeff Bagwell. Uh, P.S. Bring back Barstool Police. They actually gave me a key, so I'll take that. You know, who doesn't want handcuffs for like extracurricular activities? The thing is, it's one of those things, and I think girls like it, but. Just know where to handcuff to, I know where to handcuff girls. It's like I'd handcuff them to air. Kids show, by the way. So like handcuffs, that's for you're arrested. And yeah, I kept the key, big deal. I'll see if I have anywhere. What is this? The rain, oh. This is, this is custom gear, people. Because this is for trading. DDTG, myinvestingclub.com. The range is hot. I'll tell you what has to be hot. The fucking range has to be. Keep pushing the rock. Look at these fucking custom things. Davy Day Trading. Run the... Run. Mike Welker, you useless son of a bitch. How is this person, who I think is in high school, coming up with fucking far better shit than you do? DDTG. My investing... I mean, look at this fucking thing. Do you think he's just sitting there with notes being like, oh, look at what this fucking 13-year-old just did? I mean, just, it's simple. It's so simple. Just <laughs> just keep moving the rock. Like, fuck you, Welker. Come on. Did we got to have 13-year-olds send in the fucking shirts? Like, people are begging for, for Davey Day trade fucking shit. And this kid just, I don't even know who this is. And if I ask Welker to do it, listen, Mike Welker's not, look at this fucking hair. If I ask Welker to do it, or I, he's a nice guy, I should say that. Let's save those and look at those. If, but if I asked him to make this, he'd be like, I can't make it for like three weeks. The color patterns this, that these kids whip it. I mean, look at this. And the purple, the mis it's like everything's working here. I did that, I got dick print, everything with that. I have nowhere to stand now. What are you? Why is this box like this? Gary, no. Sorry. Club Pro Golf Guy. El Chapo's Taint. The toughest tool hole. Toughest tool hole stretch in Mexico. What a Milf Masters. A bunch of golf shit. What's in here? Do they want to shout out this funny golf? Or they don't even fucking, unless I already read the name of it. Oh, there goes that hat. Did I, oh, and now I'm starting. Oh, there's down a one now and the one I don't know how to use. Spring Hill Sports Bar. Rip, nobody rips more letters than me. Big fans at Sprangle Sports Bar, Neptune, New Jersey. Uh, right down the road from something because I ripped it in half. Let's put it together. Right down the road from Pete and Elders, we're 10 miles east of Pendel Freehold. Blah, blah, blah. Pandemic has disrupted the lives of our valued bars customers. Social distancing forced the bar side to be closed down. Therefore, St. Practice Day was canceled. Drink chip hunt will not take place as owners. We'll be fine thanks to SBO loans, but COVID has displaced dozens who are no, now forced to drink alone. That's just... That's just a sad letter about people being forced to drink alone. He's like, we're fine, but people have to drink alone. We feel bad. That, I feel bad for them. That's just a sad, like, hey, we can't drink. Everyone's going to drink alone. 
Beast Sports Nutrition. I'll give them the benefit of the doubt. You know how I feel about nutrition and coffee. Hey Dave, watch your show, looking for some protein. That's what the letter said. It said, I heard you're looking for protein. It's tough to make. I mean, that's just somebody who was not at all listening to the show. And I respect protein, but there's not much I can do with it. Fuck jacks. Straight, simple to the... In a tank top. A fuck jacks jet tank top. Straight to the point. By the way, send me... If jacks... I don't want to keep burying Jack's, even though it's the only pizza left. So Jack's, just send me a pizza and I'll fucking review. The reason that was so floppy was because it was sent by a person who didn't put enough ice in it. What do you want me to do? I didn't fuck you. You fucked me. Leah Penny, Indianapolis. Oh! This is why you gotta keep unboxing. This is why you gotta keep the intensity. You gotta keep it going because you never know when you get a thoughtful, weird fucking gift. And this is for sure one. Look at these fucking. Those are fucking sick. Look at the art on that shit. I mean, this is detailed. You got Barstool there. You got the man on the moon. Oh, my God. See? And you got Randolph and then Stella Bean Portnoy. Look at that. Vans. The NASCAR Barstool. Like the detail on this thing. The one bite on the side there. Pretty fucking sick. Oh, and then she put pictures of her dogs. Man. My name is Leah Penny. I'm a huge stoolie. I created the Luggage Guy shirt design, Trent, and Wolf of Ball Street mug. I thought I would add more to your collection. Enjoy the shoes. At Penny Leah. My dogs are also huge fans. I think she sent two, but we'll let her get away with it because these are fucking... Like, I don't let her wear these. Now, I won't give them away because Stella, they're just like something cool to have on a desk what's going on in here who are you from who are you from i don't know and why do i feel weird about you i just have that spidey sense when i'm when something's off with it. nope just shirts just shirts and a half trump just a trump and a bottle of wine Davis Bynum, Russian River Value, Pinot Noir. I bet that's a fucking good bottle. That's my only thing I know about wine, people. If it's a Russian River Pinot Noir, it's the real deal. Trump International Hotel. What is? Who is this from? Hey, Prez, this package comes to you from security team at Trump Chicago. Those pictures you see were taken by me personally, 90 floors on the roof. Next year, next time you're in Chicago, ask Phil or Aaron, we'll give you a tour of the building. Oh, fucking, all right, what do we got here? Open here. I'm like fucking myself with this fucking board right now. It's in between my legs. It's just another mini, mini like surfboard. Smells. Must be like woodwork or something. Ooh. Fuck. Alright. There we go. We back. That was the only brief knockover. Yeah, wood. Huh. Dave, surfer hair, fresh baked chocolate chip cookie tan, Figo, <laughs> Fiji over water bungalow blue eyes, a little reminder of the better days ahead. Best, Dr. Tom Chipiata, Optimum, Optimum Performance Chiropractor in Midtown, New York. Ooh, that's actually really nice too. Page views? Like right there. And that's a good way to do it. He's a chiropractor. He sent like a cool gift. Again, I don't know what to do with it. I think, I think Barstool fans, like I just, as much as I love it, like I don't know that I can have all this stuff as like a throne to myself. I don't hate it. Don't get me wrong. It's like, I'm not saying I don't have an ego, but 
all this noise and hear all this junk. This pack was proudly assembled in Buffalo, New York. Nice stationery, better than we got. Stag pack. We built professional gift packs. Okay. Uh, what do we got in here? Ooh, knives. Cigar holder. Stag pack. Getting there, what time do we got? Yeah, right about 11, just like I thought. This is it. Last, oh, we got two more coming that you see. This group, and then two more after that. And then the unboxing, 13 is in the books. And we'll wait for the next one and hopefully get Marshmallow on. What is this? Dave, don't send me stuff. Highlights from unboxing. I don't understand. He's just doing his own. It's like a shirt, a picture of himself. I didn't get that. Do not bend me. Kojo Sport. Toronto. A little action from Toronto. Our neighbors to the north. Oh! A signed Ray Bork shirt? Are you fucking kidding me? Look at this fucking bad boy. A sign fucking Ray with not a whole lot of like who they even are. Just like a sign fucking Captain Ray Bort. How do you like not give more detail on who you are unless I missed it? Tag me, tag me for the ad because this thing's fucking badass. Big time. Richardson. Someone just said, this has to be like a well thing, right? A Richardson hat? Where does this say it's from? Vintage Hawkins. Who does it, what company? Does it say the company? No, weird. Unless I just fucking missed it. What is this? A bunch of fucking blank hats? This had to be a welfare fuck up. Had to. Uh, Friends of Feeney. Hartford. These boxes. It's late in the game to get these fucking boxes. Oh, little pull tab. All right. Didn't deal with. Oh, didn't pull at all. These fucking FedEx boxes. That's how you slice yourself right in that motion. Friends of Feeney. It's kind of a cool sweatshirt. I don't know what it means. It looks like there's something else in there. El Prez is my friend. I don't know. Is there a note? Yeah. Friends of Feeney. Our mission is to help children and families who need assistance after heartbreaking tragedy. Hoodie and t-shirt donation. Very thoughtful to display our swag. Friends of Feeney is a mission to help channelers who need assistance. Please can you spread the good word about our West Hartford based organization. So I don't know if do they need merch. Is that what they're saying? I don't know. We'll keep that. That could be something that we give a bunch of shit to. I couldn't really understand what they were looking for. It just sounded like they were friends. Ah! What are you? A t-shirt? Respect your package. Okay. I can respect that. I can... A lot of dick stuff today, right? Am I making that up? But this works for me because we're in the package game. Do uh, you know what they call this? Ouch! Nice try, late in the game. A double entente. Respect your package because we're opening nonstop packages. Respect your package. I think for this is probably your dick because they have underwear. Dick carriers. Oh uh, yeah, respect your pack. Dick carriers. Dick carriers. I know this is you've sent multiple. All right, we got two more left. 
This poster guy, ouch, I'm getting attacked from behind. Dick carriers, you can't send multiple. I'm wearing your hat like an idiot too because I like the package double on time. All right, true speed. This thing's taped up like a motherfucker. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Late. Late in the game to be doing this. All right, that should do it. I think. is this a basic trainer uh, i don't know if there's more in there that didn't come out all right last one this thing's fucking light last one unboxing 13 this one actually went longer than i fucking thought it was three hours don't cut yourself and end it this has to be a weapon right that didn't do it stick is there any gonna be like well, it's kind of weird that i'm wearing like the bork shirt with it a bauer hockey stick no customization though is there anything else in this no let me see if i got one more end that's not fucking uh that's gonna be that That's it. That's all she wrote. That is, and now I'm standing on just charcoal. That's the unboxing 13. Appreciate everybody sticking with us. Over 20,000 people again. Three hour show. I fucking appreciate it. Um, I don't know what else to say. I fucking appreciate it. Tomorrow, 8 p.m., we'll do the cheese ball challenge. And here's what we're going to do. We're gonna figure out a way to do it. We're giving a cash away, but only to one person. We're gonna give care packages away. So like, we will pack up a ton of this shit. If you pick the right over under on cheese balls, we'll mail you a care package. Until then, everybody, look at this fucking thing. I'll see you next time.